Hey guys, we're back with another episode of No BS with Brett and Seb. This time, we're breaking down multifunctional finishing. Over the last few years, the landscape of the printing industry has changed and businesses have had to do more with way less manpower. This has made it important to automate time-consuming and monotonous processes like creasing, folding, and perfect. Yeah, and the challenge with making this type of investment for business owners has traditionally been that they think these types of machines don't make the money. It's kind of true. It actually saves you money. And at the end of the day, this is just as important. We're gonna present you with three different types of printers and their experiences to show you why a crease and fold is likely a wise investment. Printer number one, if you don't have enough work for automated equipment, so you or your staff crease and fold by hand. Two hours later. The problem with this is that it's extremely time consuming. You're paying a staff member a minimum of $15 an hour. A crease and fold costs $30 a day. If your staff spend more than two hours a day creasing and folding, you're losing money by not investing in the right automated equipment. And that kind of sounds a bit like an infomercial. Yeah, but this George Foreman will actually grow. Good point. Now printer number two, you have automated equipment that will crease and fold separately. You may be slightly ahead of printer number one, but you know the daily challenges you face. Number one, machine setup. You have two machines to set up that do not speak to each other. Even on a good day, this creates waste. You have to print more overs than you should, and we all know there's been some days where even the overs aren't enough, so you have to print again. Number two is time. This leads us into how much time it actually takes. Two machines means double the touch points and double the time in every aspect. This takes the operator and the machines twice as much time to do the job. Number three, do we even want to talk about static? The more machines you run through, the more static issues down the line. This creates more waste and more frustration. Printer number three, you send your work out. Did you know that paying your courier to ship it back and forth can actually pay for the crease and fold itself? Okay, so what does a crease and fold actually do? It automates your workflow. This will free up employees, decrease turnover time, reduce waste, and all in all, save you money. Well, how it works, it's simply just input your paper size, fold type, and the machine will accurately put the crease in the right spot. Not all machines are created equal. You want to choose a machine that is consistent, durable, and will last for years to come. And again, for $30 a day, you can deliver a high quality, consistent product to your customers within a few hours. Yeah. And we choose the Multigraph CF375 because it's Swiss made and built like a tank. It's air fed, can take a large stack of paper, and is operated with relative ease. And this is just a brief overview of how a crease and fold can help automate your business. Send Brett or I an email, which you're going to find at the end of this video, and we can help analyze your specific workflow to determine whether a crease and fold or another multifunctional finisher is the right fit for you. Thanks for watching another episode of No BS with Brett and Seb. See you later.